Hey everybody. And I'm looking a little scruffy, but guys, it's kind of hot. So I did go out earlier today and uh, yeah, guys, it was hot, you know. When it's hot, I'm not gonna be able to do the makeup. I'm just not gonna be able to do it. Um, I, I just don't see what sense it make to um, sweat makeup into my pores if it's hot. If it's hot, it's hot. And I, I got a shiner up there, y'all, but I don't even care about that. I, that makeup had to go. But anyway, guys, um, this is going to be a story time video. And actually, it was requested. Uh, and I just want to say that it, it has nothing to do with me at all. Okay, I want some feedback, even though I think I pretty much know what the majority of you ladies are going to and men. Um, I, I know what you guys are, are pretty much going to... Um, you know, think and suggest, and it's pretty much the same thing I thought and suggested, okay, so, just understand it's not my story time, someone asked me to do this, because they want some feedback, so, I'm gonna put it out there, because this is my very best friend, um, so, all right, guys, stay tuned, and I am recording from a car, I am in Miami, um, the person that I'm with is making a couple of stops, taking care of a couple things, and it's cool. You know, I probably would have been at the crib, um, probably, doing this video, so I'd rather be out and about doing it, you know. I try to make good use of my time, okay? But anyway, guys, stay tuned in. This is a nice area that I'm in, though. Appears to be a nice area. Not bad. I forgot the name of where it is, but stay tuned. Okay, so the story time goes like this. It involves a couple who was married for over 10 years. Okay, I don't have my notebook with me, so I'm going to try to remember everything, okay? But it was a couple that was married for over 10 years, and um, one day... Uh, the the wife came home and um, her husband was I guess waiting for her to get there and oh shit he um, said that hold on guys this don't feel good okay he told his wife that he wanted to basically get a divorce and that um, you know he needed you know some some time away or whatever and some space so um, he said that he wanted to get a divorce and that he wanted to get back remarried in five years. Okay. Yeah, that That's pretty much the situation, guys. Um, he wanted a divorce from her and, you know, I guess give it a break for five years. Come back in five years and remarry. Okay. So that's that's the situation um you know what do y'all think about that <laughs> um of course she thought he was cheating on her you know um you know he, she thought he was cheating um i guess things that got to the point where he would when she would come into the room he would put his phone face down and um you know, little things like that. I know that's one of them. It's probably something else I'm missing. But she basically thought that he was cheating. And to be honest, I think that most people would think, you know, their partner was cheating. But just to suggest, make a suggestion, you know, suggestion like that, I think is insane. Uh, <laughs> because you're you're married already. So a five-year break and then come back and do it again i mean that's 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 just really stupid <laughs> it's really stupid i don't really know how she can put that i mean i don't see how she would be able to to trust this man you know uh anymore you know a lot of stuff can take place in five years guys a lot of stuff like he can meet somebody else that he might fall in love with um that he might want to stay with, you know, um, that could possibly happen, or 
I mean, he 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 he's just too unstable for me, you know. That that doesn't sit well with me because I mean, in the back of my mind, if it was me personally, I would be thinking, well, if I was that stupid to wait around for this person for five years, knowing that he wanted to divorce me in the first place, and you know, I would think that if I was that dumb to remarry this person, who's to say that he wouldn't say he want another break? You know, if he called the shots on that like that, I mean, first off, you know, that's that's not cool. Like, you know, this lady's supposed to have some type of say-so, you know, over the... Anyway, all I'm saying is that it would just be really stupid because what if he decide after y'all got remarried in five years that he want to be with someone else? Or, <clears throat> or that you all may need another break from each other, you know. If you already have one five-year break, why not another one, right? Why not a couple of them, you get it? So, yeah, you just have to really be really stupid to do it. Okay, guys, so this is a continuation video from the video that I started actually yesterday. Okay, you can tell by my clothes, because I'm in my pajamas, you know, so it was yesterday when I was out and about at the beach, I started the video in the car, okay? So, I just, I just want to come back and, and say, you know, I, I want to give my spin, okay, on, uh, on that situation, you know, what I would have done, personally, just, just personally speaking now. Just according to what I told you all, you know, uh, about in this video, in the beginning part of the video. So, me personally now, okay. First off, if I came home from work and my husband of 10 years, okay, 10 plus years, uh, was waiting to have, you know, a conversation with me to tell me that he, he want to, um, that he need a break, um, that he wants to, for us to take a, a five year break and then get back remarried. Um, I would look at him like he was nuts, you know, me personally. I would say, nigga, if you feel like, if it's a nigga, uh, if you feel like, you want to take any sort uh, of break, do that. Okay, period, though. I don't know, you know. Or maybe y'all can explain to me. You know, what type of woman would do it? You know, what, what type of woman... Okay, give me some feedback on this, too. What type of woman do you think it will have to be to take a man back with a proposition like that, okay? Uh, I don't know. So, yeah, I'm going to ask y'all, if y'all know, because I know y'all probably, a lot of y'all probably feel like I do, and like, you know, if, if a person come to you, your husband, and, and he said, let's take a break because he don't want to, you know, he want to break. And when I walk into the room, he's putting his phone face down and stuff. It's all suspect. I'm going to go on my hunches and the things that I see, and I'm going to tell them to beat it. Or I'm just going to go, you know, I'm not going to even allow somebody to be in a position like that over me. I mean, who is he to decide that that's what we need to do and not just like a damn fool do it? You know, I, you know, I, I don't know. I, I don't know. I do not know what type of female would do the shit. I mean, I couldn't do it. <laughs> so, somebody tell me that they want to take a break, that is it. So, you go head on where, you, you know, your interests may lay, you know, elsewhere. And just allow me to do the same thing. Because if you don't, I'm going to do the shit anyway. So, it's better to be straight up and put it out there, the cards on the table. You know, that way... It's no problems, you know. You communicate, hey, okay, cool. You want to take a break? Okay, me too. At the end of the day, mine is a permanent break, though. You know? So go ahead on, man. You know, I wouldn't even make 
you know, make, make him feel like he was that special to even decide, you know, to be, think that he's the one to decide to do something like that, y'all. Mm-mm. I mean, to me, it's, it's just, it's not that much love, you know. And it's a lot of love. It's a lot of love, but it ain't that damn much still. You know, if you allow a man to treat you like that, oh, shit, y'all, I just, ooh, y'all just hit this bump by accident with my damn nail. Oh, y'all, it's trying to go away a little bit right there, but damn, that hurt. Oh, damn. Anyway, Sorry about that, y'all did. That shit caught me off guard. Damn, it hurt, though. My damn nail got on it. Oh, hit it. Oh. Anyway, though, I wouldn't do it. Couldn't do it. You know, I ain't the type of female, whatever type that may be, that's made like that. You know. <laughs> you know. But, but, hey, to each her own. But this little, you know, I just want to come back in this little clip or whatever you want to call it. I just wanted to, you know, throw in my personal spin on the, you know, the, the situation. No. If it's a break we need, it's a break it's going to be. But, you know, I mean, who's to say <laughs> what could happen in five years, guys? Be realistic. You know, so much, so many things can happen. Like I said earlier, so many things can happen. So, yeah, I mean... <laughs> Ooh. Uh, mm.